Right, welcome YouTube. This is a game called Robots, and it's a uh, quite new. It's still in the alpha phase, so it's uh, this version is 0 0.010, and it is consisting of modular gameplay. Well, not gameplay, but uh, vehicles are modular. So, for instance, uh, we can spawn a camera, we can alt tap to it, and then we have this camera which is guiding us. And uh, we can like put, uh, what is it, continuum block, we can attach it to this, and, and we can continue building from here on. So, for instance, we can put some wheels on it uh, and so on really uh, but the tricky part is that you kind of n don't simply build it you also need to put parameters uh, for your controls so the other part of this game is the console part for instance, we have here our engine, which is quite tricky. Um, um, I'll try to explain a uh, part of it. Um, it is controlled by your keys, which are uh, alpha and delta. So that means left and right. Uh, delta being the right key. So if you put uh, D, so V A S D, your normal controls for uh, moving. Uh, so this is delta, this is alpha. Uh, and then you notice that these engines are actually moving at a rate which is. Uh, controlled over here so if I were to say ah, this isn't turning fast enough then we just change some numbers uh, but the problem being that if I do this um, it will change for the engine only over here so they're like disproportionate right now uh, I'll try to put it back what was it two or something and this one was 0 0.5 because that was how it was set up. So we uh, and as it's like for the back, they're pretty cool to be honest. And of course it doesn't stop over here. Um, there's like a lot of different uh, setups you can make. Like for instance, uh, we and no. What is it? Uh, alpha and Delta are over here set up to the motor over here which will um, make your wheel turn well or this axle anyway uh, at a 30 degree angle if you do this uh, there's a lot of different vehicles or constructions you can do. It's basically all you can think of. Uh, like over here we have um, which is called an elbow part. Um, I'll try to highlight it. And yeah, so using alpha and delta will also make this part angle at a 15 degree angle and uh, the engine is mapped to forward and backwards keys and you can like uh, yeah put whatever the fuck uh, well actually these four engines uh, the motors over here they're all mapped in the same uh, piece so when you press forward they will all four of them uh, respond and um, it's not limited to just land-based vehicles. I'm trying to find one. This one is hovering, I think. Uh, let's see. Hmm, 
doesn't respond to controls, which is quite a shame, but yeah, <laughs> it's just doing it thing, and we're going to kind of leave it, uh, but yeah, there's like all things that you can imagine in a way, because these ones that you just saw, they're like autonom autonomous, yeah. Uh, so they just do their thing, this like a sea, star, whatever the fuck it's held together with. Um, they're called number two buttons. Um, what are these again? I'm trying to find... oh yeah, voltaic arcs. So these things hold them together. So that's why they're like... Uh, not really attached, but... You can like angle them and not really have to connect them like this. But yeah, uh, this one is doing its thing. This one as well, which is really fucking neat. To be honest, if, if you look at it, it's got like a. Uh, this, oh god, if it lands on the land, it won't be able to continue because the engines that are propulsing it are actually. Oh god. Um, hydro engines, so they only work on water, which is kind of neat because you can hear them uh, turn on and turn off when they exit or enter the water. Um, there was one that I think I could control. Yeah, this one. Uh, this one has also got two hydro engines strapped underneath. And um, its way of control is um, by the fin at the back. Um, I'll try to let you show you guys. So yeah, this one moves at I think 60 degrees or something. Let's find out. Yeah, 60. So uh, this joint uh, over here controls the fin at the back. And uh, just putting Alpha and Delta in there and. Uh, you can like move it and I think the engines are mapped to either well yeah one of them is mapped to a key each so this one controls forward um, and backwards apparently yeah I can't really tell just by looking at it but yeah there's like a lot of neat things you can do and uh, really looking forward to whatever they are going to make out of it because right now you can also um, strap what is it um, plasma cannons and shit to uh, various objects like this or um, lasers whatever just think of it and they can like put it on it. So it's like really neat. I've seen some uh, combat with this. Um, machines but yeah I think it will be like really interesting to see how it will develop uh, later on. <laughs> 